Little Sebastian. Tell us about the name Little Sebastian first of all. Well, this is Little Sebastian. We gave him a name this morning. So he is a five month old. He's a puppy, obviously. Yes. So a little five month old. We're thinking he's a dachshund corgi mix, maybe. He's at our main shelter location, so the Kansas City, Missouri Animal Shelter at 4400 Raytown Road. And he is absolutely hilarious. He's just... adorable. I, he gets puppy bites, those little sweet little puppy he bites. Does. Little yes, he'll need a few chew toys yes. just, to, just to keep him going. Well, he's a puppy learning. Yes, and we named him Little Sebastian, obviously, from Parks yeah, and Rec. Yeah, Parks and Rec. So. a little miniature horse called Little Sebastian, who we are obsessed with. Yes. And sadly, Little Sebastian doesn't survive the series. Uh, so this is, yes, he was an older horse. But um, I just got to tell you, he is so adorable. He is. He, he has great energy, but also he lays down. He's super sweet. He is. He's a, just a doll, and he's going to make anybody really happy. If you have another dog at home, he'd be a great little playmate for them. I mean, he, he will lay down eventually. Yes. Oh, yeah. No, he was laying down. Now yeah, there's no, things no, happening, and it's so exciting. And yeah, look, look, look at the face. Look at the face. He's got this one little ear that flops over. So, but he's one of the many pets that we have at Casey Pet Project right now. We are full, full, full of wonderful pets. Tell us about homes. the veterinary health. Because you need to make these little pups and kitties and everybody healthy. Too. Yes. So we have our new veterinary care center that was graciously um, built from a grant that we received from the Petco Foundation as well as donations from the public. And um, when we have donations to our Roadrunner Fund, which is our medical fund, um, that goes to support the pets at our shelter. We get on average around four to five animals a day that need extensive medical treatment. So, and that's, you know, hit by car animals. Oh, and so yeah. that's what that new veterinary care center is for is to help. <laughs> that maybe are in that. yes, that's, Petco Foundation I love to hear funded that. that's it awesome. as well as donations. Uh, I gotta get on my little high horse here just for a brief moment. People go, don't go to pet stores to buy animals. It, it's crazy. These shelters, there's so many animals, cats, dogs that need homes. And if you love a certain breed, it doesn't matter. There will be a shelter for that breed. There will be a, you know, a pet rescue for that breed. So please, there's so many of the pets that need homes. Absolutely. Don't buy them. You can go and save them. And you got on your little Sebastian to tell us that, didn't you? you I got on my little Sebastian. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, Joe. Thank you very much. <laughs> you're you're oh, all silly. Silly. That's, you're uh, silly. So Sebastian needs a home. A lot of pets at, the, at your place need a home. And you also have the veterinary care clinic now, which is a wonderful addition. Wonderful, yeah. And you're always so all to bring in these great pups. Thanks for doing Thank that. you Thank so you much. Thank you for having us. Don't forget, KC Pet Project is open most days from 11 to 7, and it is in the Overland Park. Come on, Jim. We're going to take a little walk while we look at that information. Thank you, Tori, so much. That's very nice of you.